Hey, beautiful people. So I want to talk to y'all today about temporary standstills. Temporary standstills are only temporary, okay? As long as you are following God and let, allow Him to order your steps, and I must always state that because some people, you know, just live off life on their own understanding, and you can't do that, okay? At the end of the day, you got to pick and choose which side are you on. Are you serving God or are you serving the devil? It's no in-betweens or none of that. So if you're serving God and you find yourself at a temporary standstill, just know that it's only temporarily. Sometimes he has to put things in play for us. And sometimes it takes more than the time that we expect. As they say, God works on his timing. Everything happens in his timing. So if he is ordering your steps and he is guiding you, then it is helping you. He are helping you on his timing. And when he helps you in his timing, he's opening doors for you that no man can close. Nobody can close that door for you. So trust the process. Right now, I am speaking because I am at a temporary standstill in my life. But I trust him and I know that he has something in store for me that is amazing tremendous that a door for me that I can't even believe open okay and it's always important to go ahead and thank him in advance and I thank him now for whatever it is that he have in store for me whatever he is setting up for me right now I thank him for it and I trust the process so trust the process and just know that it is only temporarily okay so right now I like I say I am at a temporary standstill but I trust the process okay I trust God I'm not going to worry I'm not going to faint I'm not going to panic and I also I had to also you know bring myself back to this point because for a while at, in my temporary standstill I was kind of not losing myself but kind of just slowly letting go you know because I felt like I thought I got over this hurdle you know I thought that you know I I, I didn't think that I would be back at this point again but um I knew I'd done nothing wrong, and I knew that I prayed every night, and I asked God to order my steps. So then I had to remind myself, if you're going to sit here and you ask him to order your steps, and you're praying and you're telling him that you trust him, do you really? Because if you trust him, you wouldn't worry. If you trust him, you, you wouldn't be, you know, panicking, okay? So I had to tell myself, Keisha, trust the process. It'll all come in play. It'll all be revealed. Everything will be revealed to you. And you're going to see just why he had to put you at that standstill. So, no, I don't know why right now that, you know, the reason why I'm at this standstill. But I trust him. And I know that this too shall come to pass. Okay? We are all great. We are all great. We are all deserving. Everybody is deserving. But like I say, pick or choose, you know, pick what where you what side, you know, you're on. And I know what side I'm on, but I'm not perfect. I'm not perfect. I fall short sometimes, you know. So it's all about asking God for forgiveness and repenting. OK, but just because you committed a sin doesn't mean that, you know, you just stop wishing, hoping, and believing like as if he's mad at you. But that's a whole nother subject. Okay, let me slow it down. All right, let me bring it back to this temporary standstill, all right? Like I say, this too shall come to pass. Trust the process, and he got you, okay? And, and, and you will come up and out of it, okay? But allow him to order your steps and put God first in everything you do. Like I say, I'm not a perfect person, so I'm not sitting here like I'm Miss Holy Holy. No, but I know... You know, I've been through some things, so I could, and I'm going through something right now. So I can tell you that trust the process and it'll be okay. All right, good people. I just wanted to do a little short video. I haven't did one in a while. So y'all be blessed.
And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. All right.